beliefs surrounding life and death have the greatest effect on fear. Often those fears are universal. In other situations, fears are specific to a particular time, place, and culture. Recently, Americans have been introduced to Japanese horror movies in both their original versions and in their American recreations. American remakes, such as The Ring, The Grudge, and Dark Water, have been altered slightly to increase their popularity in this country, but have largely remained faithful to their original form. All three movies have become popular because they offer something new to American audiences. Through careful examinations of religious beliefs from the standpoint of evil and the afterlife, the meaning and fears represented in Japanese horror movies becomes illuminated. Although Japan has been greatly influenced by Confucianism and Buddhism, Shinto religious beliefs are the most influential in shaping the imagery of Japanese horror movies. Shinto expressions of faith are mostly in the form of shrines, which are often dedicated to family members or local deities and are thought to be a physical location of spirits or ghosts. Shinto strives rigorously to maintain traditional practices extending back to prehistory. In light of the many unsettling changes of modernization, Shinto serves as reassurance and connects with ancient roots. The conflict between modernization and tradition is a recurring theme in Japanese horror movies. In this case, rather than offering security, the traditions punish people and are pushing back in the form of ghosts. The ghosts are simultaneously supernatural and capable of using technology in their attempts to capture their victim. The ability to use technology is something seldom used in Western supernatural horror movies. The polytheistic nature of Shinto belief has an effect on how ghosts are portrayed in movies. Rather than a single god controlling destiny, the Shinto world runs through a consensus of multiple supernatural forces. Above all, these forces must adhere to the supernatural rules of the universe, and ghosts are no exception. In some Japanese horror movies, the ghosts must continue to kill those who they are obligated to kill based on the rules that they must follow. This is true even after these ghosts have gotten their wishes fulfilled. The main figures in Shinto are Kami. Kami are the spirits that dwell in natural things, and Kami can also be the spirits of the dead. Because of the existence of Kami rather than having human ghosts, there is another dimension of possibility offered in Japanese horror movies. This is why natural places and natural th things, such as trees and hills, are used as objects of possible fear, instead of using more western approaches. In one traditional example of Kami, an emperor died because he disregarded the will of Kami revealed through an oracle. The presence of an oracle in this famous story has merged into modern movies involving Kami. The oracles in the movies like The Ring and Dark Water are both children that reveal their predictions and drawings. Unlike their western counterparts, the distinction of mobility in Shinto beliefs about the afterlife gives the Kami the ability to follow their victims outside the area that they are from. In one memorable scene from The Grudge, the kami of a young boy is shown chasing a victim and is able to appear in the elevator window at every level of a tall apartment building while it's moving from floor to floor. In Shinto, it is common to give an offering of food for kami. Having this ritual gives added meaning to leaving food in a house occupied by kami. For example, the first entrance of the ghost in the ring appears after the refrigerator is left open in another example, a character in The Grudge is awoken from a nap by the sound of soup that was left on the table falling to the ground. In both cases, Kami is brought out by the accidental offering of food. In Shinto beliefs, the most dangerous ghosts are those of people who were murdered or die in disgrace. In The Grudge, the murder of a family amidst the disgrace of infidelity causes ghosts to curse those who visit the house. And in the ring, anyone who sees the tape must die as a result of her being thrown down a well. These specific types of ghosts are called Anrayu. More often than not, the Anrayu was in life someone that was considered weak 
or someone who died unjustly. This is why the typical Anrayu is a young girl that seeks revenge. Japanese horror movies have water featured prominently in the images of their craft. Shinto beliefs give great importance to the spiritual side of water. In early records of Japanese Shinto worship, it was noted that it was common for the dead and for the participants in the funeral to be immersed in water because death was seen as impure and water could cleanse this impurity. This imagery reminds us of this practice and echoes the pure and impure duality of Shinto belief by combining death and water. The popularity of Japanese horror movies may be in part because of their ability to bring new characters and expressions to the creation of horror. Consequently, the traditions of American horror genre have been changed by the revitalization of Japanese influences. This influence should be appreciated as being greater than just a cultural difference, but instead a reflection of the long-held religious traditions of Japan.